here we are just going to do a jar of rinsing of my scans okay so we have few stations on which we have scanned jar of rinsing just click on these points and you get the point coordinates here it's, it's not the real world coordinates or the coordinate system which has to be onto the scans so just we are trying to go and do a georeferencing so that it's on to the real world coordinates so to do that i have already measured my scans uh, scan stations with my gps and i have a, a file uh, a text file with the gps with the coordinates so i'm going to import the text file import open open this text file here so so i'm just giving my eastern and northern values along with the elevation and i just say like okay now my scans are here and you can see my topo points that's all all here so i need to move my scans from here to here so then it becomes to the it then it fits to the real coordinates so to do our uh, georeferencing uh, i am going into the registration tab and there is an option here for georeferencing okay uh, so we click on georeferencing and then we have the list of stations and also we have the we can choose those stations to be aligned with the topo stations so what i'm going to do is just click on this i'm going to hit by target and on the drop down here i have my uh, gps points so i just click on this point and say okay and then for this point i said i can make minimum requirement for making a georeferencing is three so i know that uh, point B is the coordinate for the station B, station 2. So just hit OK. And then I take the fourth point and I choose that station D. So these are my points, and then I also hit by this. okay now we have got the average error here uh, uh, which displayed this close to 10 centimeter and we take out the station we just unclick the station with the maximum error so then it comes down to the uh, levels rms levels which are up which are okay acceptable it's the now my rms is about 2 mm the point on the station which i have measured and the point on which the scanner was put on to measure is is somewhere off by two to three mm so that's pretty okay so just hit apply so now i've got my stations registered so if i go and pick my coordinates now then it is like in the coordinates of the real world so so in the next tutorial we'll see how we pick up lines and then stake out those lines from the scans. Thanks for watching.